What have we heard today, Paul? Yeah, morning, Mark. We've heard from the uh, lawyers of news group newspapers who own The Sun this morning. And uh, their lawyers have uh, said that there is no hard evidence, but only general pleas of voicemail interception and phone tapping uh, by The Sun. And they say uh, uh, they they say that this, the claims may point to some sort of illegal activity when it comes to uh, things like hacking voicemail and paying private investigators, but they adamantly deny that that had anything to do with The Sun. Remember, the, uh, Rupert Murdoch uh, has always admitted that uh, the now-defunct news of the world was involved in illegal information obtaining, but uh, that never happened at The Sun. So we've heard the defence from uh, newsgroup newspapers this morning. Uh, in terms of uh, Prince Harry's legal team, uh, represented by uh, David Sherborne, lawyer, uh, he's uh, uh, been listening on. We haven't heard much from him, but what we have heard is that Prince Harry uh, and Hugh Grant uh, are watching online and that we're hearing that Hugh Grant, whose case, of course, a uh, similar case against uh, uh, The Sun is also being heard alongside Prince Harry's, Hugh Grant <coughs> is expected to attend tomorrow. Yeah, and, and just to explain to people once more, Paul, this is just a preliminary hearing. This is not even a full trial as such. And, and we expect maybe that those uh, individuals, Prince Harry and, and Hugh Grant, would have to appear then in court in person to take that through. Yeah, absolutely. That's if it went to uh, a full trial. This is a preliminary hearing. So the uh, the Sun, uh, represented by their parent group, news group newspapers, have brought this claim to try and strike it out, strike out Prince Harry's uh, uh, legal case before it gets to court. And of course, we know that Rupert Murdoch has preferred to settle out of court, that he doesn't want it dragged through. We saw with the Dominion uh, vo uh, voting company over in the United States recently that uh, they settled out of court £635 million through Fox News, which uh, of course is also owned by uh, Rupert Murdoch. So he prefers to settle out of court. He won't want it going to trial. He won't want details of how the sun operates uh, uh, made public in court. And so, uh, yeah, it should be interesting to hear what happens tomorrow on day three of this preliminary hearing.